Initially, in parathyroid hyperplasia, chief cells increase in number, resulting in diffuse hyperplasia, which is accompanied by a reduced number of calcium-sensing receptors and vitamin D receptor expression, resulting in PTH resistance. As parathyroid hyperplasia progresses, the parathyroid glands may become hyperplastic with formation of nodular hyperplasia. Glands with nodular hyperplasia have the greatest reduction in calcium-sensing receptors and vitamin D receptor expression. Cells in nodules may grow monoclonally and proliferate aggressively, and under continued long-term stimulus, progressive increases in parathyroid gland size and mass occur. Glands can weigh over 5,000 milligrams, and greater than 85% of glands weighing more than 500 milligrams contain nodular hyperplastic tissue. Once patients have advanced to severe hyperplasia, they can become resistant to treatment. Therefore, it is important to avoid progressive increases in PTH.